Hello there, I am Debbie. Welcome to Debbie Chibi TV. Guys, guys, this film I'm about to tell you is an interesting watch. I kid you not. This film is an epic historical biopic movie. Do you understand? Okay, epic historical because it's a story that happened in Oyo in the 17th to 18th century and it's biopic because it's about the story of Basharuga and the Oyo Empire. So now do you understand? Let's continue. This film is from the stables of Bolanle Austin Peters as both the producer and the director and written by Tunde Babalola. God, where do these people get their inspirations from? Jesus Christ. These people are so... Anytime I just see Bolanle Austin Peters movie, I'm always excited. So now let me give you a summary of the plot. Set in the ancient Oyo Empire, the story kicked off with a fierce warrior named Ga, who alongside his sons fought the Nupe warriors in a land conquest and emerged victorious. After the triumphant battle, Ga was celebrated as a hero. Then and there, the Alafi of Oyo appointed him as the Basharu of Oyo and its environs. But hold on, the story didn't just end with a victory parade. No. Beneath Gaz's celebrated success laid deceitful ambitions. With the help of his medicine man, Ga fortified himself with medicinal powers and charms to become a demigod. When he assumed authority, he imposed unopposed rules. He was feared by all, including the Oyo Messi, and even became more powerful than the Alafins he enthroned. And so he made the Alafins dance to his tunes. Can you imagine that? Things got intense when Ga sought to remain unchallenged. His authority spiraled into tyranny, which led to disastrous consequences. The once mighty house of Basharu Ga became a target and a battleground. The house of Ga is basically the story about the rise and fall of Basharu Ga. This film is an indigenous Yoruba film, but is subtitled in English. So because this film is a good film, I want you guys to watch it and um, experience it for yourself. Okay. And so if you're not um, from the Yoruba tribe or if you don't understand Yoruba, I would, um, let me just explain some things to you so that when you're watching it, you would understand it better or you will just flow along. Okay. The Alafin is um, the king. Okay. He's the head of the Oyo Empire and the Oyo Misi is the seven hereditary kingmakers. They are seven in number and they are responsible for installing a new Alafin. That's for installing a new king. Okay. And the head of this Oyo Misi is the Bashiru. So these people are like the electoral council. All right. And now the Bashiru is the head. He's the leader of this um, Oyo Misi. So these people, they work closely with the Alafin. And then the Ilari is um, a government officials that collect taxes from the people and, um, you know, give the Alafin his court. So they are more like um, governors. So in the movie, the Alafin that was awaiting coronation appointed Ga to become a Basharu, that is the head of the kingmakers. And so Basharu refused to install the person that appointed him to become the Alafin. This film had a lot of characters, featured good actors like Femi Branch, um, the Basharu guy himself. Oh God, I cannot get over his performance. I just nominated him for so many AMBC categories. <laughs> okay, so um, Femi Branch has been there for a long time. In case you don't know him, don't think he's a new actor. No, he has been there for a very long time, from the time of, um, what was that, that thing? Dominoes, right? If I can remember correctly, he has been there for a very long time, so I didn't expect anything less. His performance in this movie was... Mm, go and watch it. Go and experience the movie for yourself. I cannot remember all their names like that, so I'll just mention them by their real names. Hoke Akindele, the senior wife of Basharuga, um, Femi Adebayo, Basharuga's younger brother, Latif Adedimeji, Basharu Gaz, younger brother, um, Toy Ibrahim, is it Toy Ibrahim? Toy Abraham, sorry, Ibrahim Chata, mm, the medicine man 
of Fashion Ruga. Yeah, his performance, oh god. And then Mike Afolari, Yemi Black, you know, a lot of good actors. So if you're a fan of historical films, if you're a fan of Nollywood films, if you're a fan of action films, intrigue, suspense, you know, this movie is for you. Now listen, if you have not subscribed to my channel up until now, please click that button and subscribe to my channel. Like this video, share your thoughts in the comment section if you have watched this film. Let me know what you think about the film. Let me know well, if you like the film or not. Okay, so share your thoughts in the comment section. So until next time, guys, happy watching. Keep loving Nollywood.